Hey, what's to you, YouTube fam? It's your girl TK, and I'm in my car vlogging, darling. And I decided that I wanted to get online real quick, and I mean a real, real quick, and speak to you guys about Miss Beyonce Knowles Carter. Now, in this video in particular, I wanted to ask you about her status as a queen. Now, a couple days ago, I got online and I was asking y'all, let me hear you say, "Hey, Miss Carter." Yes, we were talking albums, and one of the things that I want you guys to note here is that Miss Beyonce Knowles Carter let us know through the Mrs. Carter album that she was a queen. Now, I don't know if y'all realize it, but Miss Beyonce is actually taking us down that same road she already has taken us down through the Mrs. Carter world tour. My question is, why is she duplicating herself? Why is there a need for her to let us know that she's not only the king in the United, excuse me, she's not only the queen in the United Kingdom, but she's also the queen in the United States. Why is she going back and duplicating herself? Because if you were to go on any website and review Miss Beyonce's um, like timeline, hell, go on Wiki. Wiki has a lot of information where it will tell you that Beyonce actually was basically duplicating the Queen Elizabeth. So why does Beyonce at this point in her life feel the need that it's necessary to go back and duplicate and say, I'm a queen? We already know that. You've already established that. We know that you are the queen bee. Now, of course, my phone is, you know what, it's too early in the day of morning for my phone to be dead. But last night I didn't charge it. So I had to just touch my phone just now to let me know that it's on 20%. Anyhow, y'all. Y'all gonna have to let me know, what do you guys think about her reduplicating herself? Now, a couple of years ago, I think that um, Mrs. Carter album came out like seven, eight years ago. Um, seven, eight years ago, Beyonce had more energy. She, but she was younger. But still, she had more energy. And Beyonce always had that um, passion. She was always passionate. And this uh, world tour right here, she seems tired, lethargic. She doesn't seem like she has a lot of passion for what she's doing, but she is on her job because that's Beyonce. There's a lot of set eras. You know, even I've made videos asking, is she okay mental health wise? Beyonce has always been a perfectionist, you know, even with her photos. She never would want leaked photos of her looking in, like with imperfections. All of a sudden, you're seeing imperfections in everything she does. I find that very interesting as of recent, you know, just to see Beyonce being flawed and not flawless. That is a difference in what she's doing from when she was in the Mrs. Carter World Tour than the Renaissance World Tour. Another thing is... Um, with this world tour that she's on now with the Renaissance, she's also letting us know that there's no real unity in her relationship with Jay-Z, which I find very interesting. Because in the Mrs. Quarter World Tour, that's what she was introducing to the world. That not only was she not a single lady, but she was married to Jay-Z. She took her vows, her commitment, her faith, everything that's attached and tied to her man she took it serious and um it appears now she's not doing that she's not taking her vows and her commitment very serious it's very much so giving a thriller but y'all gonna have to let me know in the comment section below what you guys are thinking i was supposed to do this video last night but i was tired okay I fell asleep. I took my time and um, made me something to eat last night. I had some salmon. I don't know how y'all say it, but I say salmon. Um, but yeah, I took my time and um, I just relaxed last night. And I got a little bit more energy, so I am making some videos on the go. Now, currently, I like to tell y'all how hot it is. It is 86 degrees here in Florida. I mean, it's hot, but it's better than to be in like 105, so it's tolerable. Like, very tolerable at this current time. Because, honestly, it felt like my face was burning, like, from it being so hot outside. That's how hot it's been, y'all. It's been terrible outside. Anyhow, I'm going to start my day. 
and I'm going to be making videos throughout this day. So I'm going to holler at y'all later. I just wanted to share that insight with you guys. Holla at you later. Peace, love, and happiness. Remember always, stay safe, stay blessed. Follow laws, rules, and regulations. Um, just note that I do have a community tab that you are more than welcome to check out if you are interested because there's a lot of information on there, okay? Also, um, I do have Instagram. I'm not on there as often, but it's there. It's T-K-K-N-O-W-L-E-S-0-1. Peace, love, and happiness, guys. Bye.